and welcome back. So here is the Dollar General breakdown for the 5 of 25 for Saturday, March the 31st. Now, I'm giving you guys three different options. The first option will be the, um, the deals that I plan on doing as long as my store is in stock, of course. And keep in mind that the 5 of 25 coupon is a digital coupon that you would load to your card. Now, if you did in fact shop throughout the week at Dollar General, you may have received a 5 off 25 paper coupon at the bottom of your receipt, and you can definitely utilize that coupon as well. Just keep in mind that when you are doing your transaction, it's either one or the other. So it's either the paper coupon or the digital coupon in one single transaction. You will not be able to utilize both coupons in the same transaction. So, what I do like about the paper coupons at the bottom of the receipt is that it's not tied to anyone's card. So you definitely can double dip if you wanted to. So for instance, if you wanted to do more than one transaction, you can use the digital coupon first, do that transaction, and then turn around and use the paper coupon on your second transaction. So just keep that in mind. It's either digital or paper in a single transaction. All right, so I have three different options here. And again, the first option is what I'm planning on doing as long as my store does have all the products in stock. So I'm going to pick up four of the hefty trash bags. This week they're on sale for $4.95 each. They have assorted sizes, so definitely make sure you're double checking your prices and always pick up the larger count. Now if your store is not tagged or if they are mistagged, just simply take your products up to the register and your cashier can definitely scan them to see exactly what the price is. So I'm going to get those and then I'm going to also pick up four of the Febreze products priced at $3 each. Now the store has several different Febreze products, so make sure that you're picking up the right ones priced at $3, that way the math does add up. So for the Febreze, they are on promotion for a spend 12 and you save $2 instantly. Now for those instant saving coupons, you don't have to do anything special. Once the cashier hits total, that coupon will apply um, and come straight off the, the total of your products. Now what you want to make sure that you do is that you definitely have your total written down, whether you use my breakdown or you write it out yourself. That way when you get to the register, if anything is off, if the um, amount that you had calculated was less than what the register is telling you before tax, then you know for sure that something did not apply or maybe the cashier rung up a product twice, etc. It's easier to fix it while you're at the register versus having to come back um, and try to fix it later. So definitely make sure you're writing down your totals before you get to the register. And then on the hefty trash bags, there are promotion as well. When you spend 15, you save $3 instantly. So I'm going to be picking up those items. My total before coupons would be $31.80. After all coupons are applied, my total would be $11.80 plus tax. Now I do have it listed here where you can find those coupons. That way it's easy for you guys. And then on option number two, so if you want to pick up paper products, the Cottonelle Toilet Paper, the 12 Big Rolls, as well as the Ultra, um, it's the Ultra Comfort or Clean Care that are priced at two for nine. And then the Scott Paper Towels or the six large rolls and they're priced for two for nine. Definitely make sure you're looking in your store for the bonus pack. I have seen them at the Dollar General um, for the Scott Paper Towels. So you want to always pick up more bang for your buck. So for those, they're on sale again for two for nine, and then they're part of the same instant savings at the SD Hefty Trash Bags. When you spend 15, you save $3 instantly. And then you would also be picking up four of the Febreze products. Again, make sure they're priced at $3. So your total for four coupons is $30 after all coupons are applied, $11 plus tax. And again, I have it listed where you're gonna find those coupons at. All right, and then your very last transaction or last option, I should say, not transaction, last option, is if you want to do the paper products and the trash bags, you can definitely do so. So you can pick up two of the hefty trash bags. Again, they're $4.95 each. And then you can pick up two either of the Cottonelle or Scott, or you can pick up one of each. Now, they're on sale two for nine, and that's, again, for both Scott and the Cottonelle. So I don't see why they would not allow you to mix and match and get one Cottonelle and one Scott and still have a price point of two for nine. I'm not quite sure on that. So if anyone does know for sure that Dollar General does allow mixed matching when it comes to their products, just as we're normally used to with um, CVS, Walgreens, and Target, Kroger, etc., then definitely let us know down below in the comments. So two for nine, 
and again you have the option of either two cotton nail two scott or maybe one of each so then we still want to be picking up four of the Febreze products. So I total the four coupons is $30.90. After all coupon supply, we're looking at $11.40 plus tax. So that is that, guys. That is everything that I have for you for the Dollar General. And again, with the Dollar General and the Family Dollar, um, I will be looking at those stores for being able to stock up on cleaning supplies and paper products and so on. Things that we don't always get a rock bottom deal for at CVS um, or even at Walgreens for that matter. So definitely being able to stock up at this price point is key. And again, I always say the key to couponing is definitely having a stockpile. I like to think of my stockpile as just a mini little emergency fund, if you will, because, you know, life happens and it happens quite often, pretty much. But there are several other items um, on sale and on promotion. There's an the instant savings for $2 off when you spend six on any Suave products. So definitely if you need any of these items, you can pair up your coupons with those. And there's a rebate on the Suave shampoo or conditioner as well as Suave um, stylers on Ibotta. So you definitely can pair that up if you're needing those as well. I personally am not in need of any of those items. There's a Ibotta rebate for the um, Honey Bunches of Oats as well. And Dollar General has a digital coupon, so you can pick it up for 99 cents and then submit a, um, I think it's 15 cent for the post um, honey bunches of oats. But that's what my eye about to have. Was it with 15 cent or maybe 50 cents, something like that. Uh, but yep, yeah, so that's pretty much it, guys. Now, again, if you have found this video helpful at all, definitely comment down below letting me know. Definitely give this video a big thumbs up. We're going to learn to master the Dollar General and the Family Dollar like butter, the same as we do with CVS and Kroger's and all that jazz there, to be able to build up our stockpile and come out with the biggest bang for our buck and savings overall. Now guys, I will probably be out of pocket for most of the day tomorrow, so if you have any immediate questions for me, definitely hit me up on Instagram as that's the easiest way to get me and I will definitely respond back as soon as I can. Now, just in case I don't get a chance to chat with anyone before Sunday, I wanna wish everyone a beautiful and blessed Easter. Definitely take some time to spend with family, put your feet up, relax, chill out. Don't stress about anything, especially couponing. The deals can wait. They will always be there and always come back around. I myself will not be shopping on Sunday, so I won't see you guys again until Monday in my Monday haul. Uh, for CVS. So until then guys, take care, have a beautiful and blessed weekend, and happy couponing.